NDP leader Jack Layton has been making an all-out assault on more oil sand development. But in Saskatoon recently on a radio talk show, host John Gormley took issue with some of Layton's assertions. Who's going to pay to clean up uh, these toxic uh, uh, ponds? They're enormous. You can see them from space. Who's well, the, the same people who cleaned up the last ponds. The people who developed pardon? them, the same people who cleaned up the last ponds, as you reclaim each site, you clean it up and you put trees back on. Well, actually, none of the lands in the uh, tar sands have been reclaimed, and none of the ponds have been reclaimed, and the companies So you're saying there's been no reclamation since correct. 1978 in the early Sin crude days? That's right, and okay. uh, that's why we took the, uh, the media there uh, yesterday to show them, because people don't believe it, uh, but it's true. But it's not entirely true. Gormley did some digging and then posted what he found on his blog, citing statistics that show some of the oil sands have been cleaned up. Faced with the blogger's reality check, the NDP admitted Leighton got his facts wrong. And I immediately issued a, uh, a, a stand as corrected statement on Mr. Gormley's uh, blog. Uh, when you're running for the position of Prime Minister, I think you need to be big enough to admit that you made a mistake. Of course, we were 99.8% correct, only 0.2% or 0.02, pardon me, uh, of the tar sands that have been developed so far has been reclaimed. But Leighton didn't correct it on radio. The blog was faster, says the NDP. Uh, you can't go back uh, in radio and, and, uh, until the next day or the next show. But in between, there are, there are media available to kind of make a connection. I think that's one of the, the great things that, uh, that things like blogs uh, for, 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 for listeners to go to. And that correction is confined to the blog.